Dragoon of Red Eyes is going to change Yu-Gi-Oh! forever. And this card is getting released next week. What if I told you that Pendulums could play this card so easily in their deck and it makes going second and going first way easier and better? It's absolutely an amazing way to play the deck and I'm going to show you guys right now. Dragoon and Demian, and it's arguably the best way to play this deck. But before we do, don't forget, guys, that Pendulum's the best deck. And you guys are going to play on a beautiful Toon Electromite, Clock, Play, Ma Imagine that right now. You guys see Toon Electromite right there? Then imagine Dragoon right there in the extra monster zone. Boom! Just Dragoon right there. It's like, uh, it can't be an extra monster zone because it'll be something by Birdie Anaconda. But it'll be like right there. Right there. Ready to wreck havoc on your opponent. That's right, baby. Get yours now before Dragoon comes out. Because by the time Dragoon comes out, these will be sold out. So get yours as soon as possible. Sign on the Pendulum training down below. I can teach you guys how to play Pendulum properly. And Dragoon Red Eyes. Get ready to see absolute greatness. I'm going to fast forward these two combos in a row. They both they do both. it. Any hand does it. Any hand does it. Uh, whether you draw souls or not. So all you got to play is Dark Magician and Magicalized Fusion. Stay tuned to the end. I'll show you guys how to do it in the deck profile. Discuss everything and why. You don't need to play a Dragon card for it. Uh, because it's part of the combo. And Magicalized Fusions allows it to do any uh, dragon. It doesn't need to be specifically uh, a card that's listed like in his name. It doesn't need to be Red Eyes, like the other ways to, to do it. But with Magicalized Fusion, you can just be any anyone. So I'm gonna show you a very easy way. So I'm just gonna fast forward the whole the whole way. They don't have if they don't Ash already, they don't have Ash. I'm gonna fast forward up to the point where it's like where you actually do the combo. Uh, so here, Celine is uh, so it's very cool the fact that uh, Dark Magician is level seven is very cool because you can actually summon out with Celine as many times as you want to play, do absolute vortex combos. And the only way to do it is you actually link off the absolute. You use Magicalized Fusion for Absolute Dragon and Dark Magician. And because Absolute Dragon is a dragon in the graveyard, uh, dragon effect monster, Magicalized Fusion, you can fusion anything. Uh, so you're just gonna easily do Celine, summon. You go restage to bring out Souls. Now Souls and the uh, Verde Anaconda. Uh, so the two of these, you guys read Verde Anaconda, it says, you can pay 2,000 light points and a fusion or poly normal or quick play spell from your deck to the grave, and this card gains the effect. So, you will, the card you're going to send after that is going to be Magicalized Fusion. This card says Fusion Summon once Buckcast a Fusion Monster from your extra deck by banishing Fusion Materials listed on it from your field or grave. So you're going to banish Dark Magician Absolute from your graveyard, and then summon a Dragoon of Red Eyes. So the difference of this is the other way to do it, uh, it's special from deck, but because this deck inherently has a dragon to go and a dark magician, all it needs is a dark magician and dragon. The other way to bring out Dragoon and Red Eyes is by, like, literally, you need, like, Red Eyes and Dark Magician. But this region, you're allowed to do this. And look at this board. What deck in the planet is clearing this board? Vortex, Jackal, Right Hand, Double Mighty Master, and Dragoon. Good luck, have fun, bro. What deck in the planet is clearing this? I don't even have space for the Mighty Master here, bro. I don't have space for the Mighty Master in my scale. I didn't use that effect. This deck is absolutely ridiculous. Like, amazing. Look at the follow-up. Abductor searching on six counters. Good luck, have fun to anyone that plays me when Dragoon comes out, bro. Dragoon and Red Eyes, well, this deck's crazy. For those who don't know what this card does, neither player can target this card. Neither player can target or destroy this card of card effects. Whoa, sounds familiar, doesn't it? So how the hell, if they can only, if one, if decks have one out of Dragoon and Red Eyes, how are they dealing with Dragoon and Red Eyes and a Mighty Master that can't be targeted or destroyed? Like, it's absolutely ridiculous how good they are. And it makes it even better. During your main phase, you can destroy one monster your opponent controls to inflict damage to your opponent for it. You can use effect you uh, Okay, so this card could uh, also destroy a card on your turn. And on top of that, it's a negate, negate. Once per turn, when a card effect is activated, discard a card, negate the activation. And if you do, uh, this card gains a thousand attacks. This card's gonna be a 4k attack. How the hell are you gonna defeat a card that's 4k attack, cannot be targeted or destroyed? Kind of like 2800 attack, cannot be targeted or destroyed. 10 best deck, boys. So we have two Mighty Masses now, different ones. Dragoon Red Eyes and Mighty Masses look the same thing too. So that's the video. I'm gonna show you guys a quick one next uh, to do it now. Also, there's a way to do it with, well, without Magician Souls. I'll explain it. This comment tutorial, we did open Magician Souls again, but you do it without Magician Souls. It's literally either way. Magician Souls just makes it easier because you send Dark Magician, but it's a very easy way as well. So if you don't have Magician Souls, if you don't uh, you don't even need to play it, it just makes it the combo even easier. I can show you guys another video in the future if you guys want to see how to do it. But the gist of it is, instead of going Absolute Dragon, you go into Ebon Illusion Magician. Ebon Illusion Magician will then special out the Dark Magician from your deck. Uh, what Deep Illusion Magician sa says is two level 7 monsters, so instead of Absolute and Vortex, you just go into that. And Absolute Vortex, so you bring out an Ebon Illusion Magician, Ebon Illusion Special Dark Magician, and then Dark Magician, you go into Imduck, uh, and then just like that, you have a Dragon, and Imduck and uh, that will go, so another board here. Uh, sorry for that proxy in Masquerade Night, I just forgot to put it in the extra deck at this point, but it's obviously it's supposed to be in the deck. So uh, you have Jack the Right Hand, Dragoon Red Eyes, Masquerade and Vortex Dragon. Good luck, have fun. And don't worry about not even having a card in hand because you'll get it back. Uh, because, yeah, after Jackal negates, you link Mascarena, Verte, and Jackal into Selene. 
uh, go into a Mighty Master and Mighty Master, Bounce Servant, and then you could Dragoon Negate. Until then, you have a thousand, ten thousand negates to negate, anyways. Uh, but yeah, now uh, I'll show you guys how to do the combo with soul uh, without souls now. The deck profile quickly before we get into it. The only two cards you play uh, to make the combo possible is one Dark Magician and one Magilux Fusion. If you hard draw any of them, it makes the combo easier. If you hard draw Dark Magician, it is just a level seven. It's a dark and it's a level seven and it's a spellcaster, spellbook of knowledge target. So it actually, in a weird way, the ultimate wizard in terms of attack and defense actually synergizes with this deck in a very weird way. I know, buy it soon, like to my call play, matchupgaming.com uh, because it synergizes cool. Uh, <laughs> Magilized Fusion, this is the only card you really, hard, really want to hard draw. If you hard draw Dark Magician, I can't stress this enough. It literally doesn't matter, fuck all whatsoever. Uh, so it's still really good. Uh, the way you do the combo, uh, you just it's an absolute dragon. You go if you don't open Magician Souls. Uh, is you instead of absolute dragon you go ebon illusion magician you already have a jackal to protect from the mirror you don't care about vortex and absolute ebon illusion will then special ebon uh, dark magician and then with imduck it says one normal monster so imduck you go to dark magician and that's your dragon there and then the imduck and the ebon illusion the two of them go into verde by itself and then verde will special out the dragoon red eyes so one rank seven equals dragoon red eyes or any link two obviously but so that's just a guaranteed if you don't open magician souls you just go into ebon illusion magician so that's a cool way to do it very cool way to do this in pendulums uh where you do it so consistently it's unbelievable uh so ebon illusion and imduck is the way you do that uh that way uh and then on top of that if you go ebon illusion is a spellcaster so you can actually you're even cooler than just verde off the bat you go ebon you go imduck and then you take some random card from your uh, field, that's like, let's say random, like Jester Confit. You have infinity extenders in the deck. A random Abductor, a random Chronograph, a random Time Gaze, a random Servant that's chilling. You bring them into Selene, and then Selene could special back the Mighty Master uh, that was summoned via Ebon, uh, that was under Ebon Illusion. And then you could link the Selene and some random card into the Verte, and the Verte could use Magilized Fusion because Magilized Fusion says from field or graveyard. So you could set up your full pendulum board after Ebon Illusion and Imduk. And then still have the dragon from Imduk and still have uh, the Dark Magician in your grave. So you still have Infinity Negates. Uh, I'll go through the whole deck profile quickly. Servant, triple, Doctor, one reflection, one jackal, triple, mighty master. Uh, one time gets a triple corner grab, double blue boy, triple souls, triple jester confit. You still need all the extenders possible. Just because you're throwing in Dark Magician, Magilized Fusion, you can't play Desires now. So because you're not playing Desires, you have to ensure that no matter what, no matter what, that you have enough ways to... Uh, extend into Crowley, enough draw cards of Blue Boy. So playing the Blue Boy, double Blue Boy, and, and six extenders here that are non-pendulum is still completely fine. Plus all the other extenders you're playing, Corner Gap, Instant Fusion, Abductor, etc. To make sure you Crowley through Hand Trap all the time. Triple Mastery, Triple Allure. Allure is, they always resolves, obviously, with Jester Comfort now. Restage is only good. Restage is only good if you play Jester Confits. If you play only Souls, then sometimes your, your, your Restage is not going to resolve. That's the only issue with Restage. Restage only bricks. So a lot of you guys played Restage before. It'll only brick if it doesn't resolve. But if you draw literally one Jester Card Fit, Restage instantly becomes very, very, very powerful. Especially because uh, of like Crowley, you go into it very easily. So it's very important. Uh, reasoning is good in this build because lots of different levels, etc. Okay. Side deck. You don't want to lose to all these cards that could make Dragoon. So the second they drop out Verde, you Gamma their ass, you uh, uh, Imperm their ass, etc. Uh, Tactical Talents is very good when Dragoon comes out. So I'm pretty sure uh, when Dragoon comes out, a lot of decks will stop playing like uh, Hand Trap decks, uh, Hand Trap dot deck decks that stop Hand Trap and instead just clear boards when they're already set up. So when that happens and when Hand Traps are not required, when people will stop playing those type of decks, we could take all the Hand Traps actually and just play Triple Tactical Talent, Triple Droplet, and cards like these that just obliterate Dragoon by itself. But when those cards are backed up by right hand and five negates, good luck, have fun, bro. <laughs> Extra deck, triple Selene, Crowley, Cross Sheep, IP Mascarena, uh, Axis Cold Talker, Relinquish Anima, Anima you need for this combo. Uh, Millennium Eyes, uh, I w I, there's no space for uh, Daybreaker. I would love to throw in Daybreaker, especially in a deck that has this many extenders. If anything, I'll take out Mascarena, but you need one card that's like Mascarena or Appaloosa to end on your board to make it a little better. Uh, I think Masquerade is a card because Masquerade just goes into Selene. It's Selene's special card, so you don't need Unicorn or Appaloosa with the Masquerade. It's just going into Selene. It's Selene summoning other card. Uh, Ebon Lujan, Absolute Vortex, Dragoon, Radiant Anaconda, and Imduck. That's the video, guys. If you like Dragoon, or, uh, Dragoon, and Demian, smash the subscribe button right now. Smash the like button as well. Let me know down below in the comments what you guys think. Don't forget to get a beautiful trip game and play at tripgaming.com because Pen Best Deck and Dragoon and Demian Pen Dome Best Deck. And I'm going to talk about a lot about Dragoon in the next week because this is a game changer, absolute meta changer. And don't forget to check Patreon where I discuss 
this in depth for you guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Yeah,